Welcome to Assassin's Creed Valhalla, it's Abyss, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to get the St. George gear set from the New River Raids. Alright, so this is what the gear looks like when it's fully upgraded. Afterwards, I will show you each piece of gear along with the two new weapons that you're going to get. There are three maps that I'm going to take you through and show you where all the collectibles are. Now, there is an important thing to note. These collectibles are random, so they might not be in the same location I'm going to show you. But it is very simple and easy to figure out where they might be at. So when you pull up a map and you hover over a raid, it will tell you a couple things. It will say gear and weapons, or it might say crafting and materials, or it might say book of knowledge, river map clues. So that's what it's going to say when you hover over a raid. So what I notice is, let's say you go to a raid and it says gear and weapons are going to be there. But when you go and discover that raid and it says small camp, I don't recommend trying to look for the gear and weapon there because most likely it's not going to have it. So from what I notice is the gear and the weapons will be at the named locations. So instead of saying small camp, it'll say something like fortified eastern northwest camp, right? It will have some type of name there instead of just small camp. So if you're looking for the gear or weapon, make sure that raid has a name to it. So for the book of knowledge, those are very simple. Pull up the map and you'll look for the gold dot and then put a marker there and then just go to that raid and look for it there. Now for the river map clues, you need to find both river map clues in order to unlock the third map. So I like to look for those in monasteries. So if you see any monasteries on the map, those are the best places to look for them. So once you find the two river map clues, just head back to your settlement and that will unlock the third and final map. At that third map, there will be another side quest. You can easily pull up the map, click on that one, and that is where you're going to find the sword. I recommend doing that last or right before you're going to leave because going through that fortress, you might lose a lot of men. So you might want to save that for right before you're going to leave the raid or if it's the last thing you want to do. Also, if your supplies are at max, like 200 of 200, then you won't be able to loot any more of the chests and you won't be able to locate any of the gear or weapon. You're going to have to leave, go back to your settlement and then reset the raid again. In the description below, I'll have timestamps for each part of this video, just in case you want to jump to any part of the video. Other than that, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, support the channel, and I will see you next time. Can't do this alone. That's enough.
Come, help me with this. Come here! Can't do this alone. 